and in all the time, have you ever heard one scandal, one scandal about Dr. Richard Mapon? Uh, there were no slay queens back then. Uh, no, they ah. were. They were now. It doesn't matter. Mm. No slay queens have been there, chief. Our mothers were. <laughs> <laughs> And chill, Matt G, the ghost lady, and Len Moleko. Gosh, she said. <laughs> I literally came at me sideways. Has <laughs> <laughs> it been that long? You forgot the Welcome clap, back. bro. <laughs> <laughs> that was uh, our crickets. Hey. Yeah. We lost the the clap, my G. Stop, please. It literally scared me. And the lights, are the lights hurting you? Now I'll survive. Is it? Could you, what happened with your eyes? I dropped a contact lens. Well, yes, one contact lens fell. And yeah. you couldn't find it. Uh, you can't. Show them your other glasses. No, no, no. Leave my glasses all out of this. And then, so because of, you can't see with one contact lens, because yeah. your, eyes, your eyes have to be in focus. So I had to get rid of it. The other one that I was there, and I had to use glasses. So my eyes had to adjust to glasses, and my glasses don't have uh, anti clay. My contacts do. Mm-hmm. So when light and whatever comes into my eyes, yeah, my retina is fucked. Were well, you disappearing that much, dog? No, no. It literally happened. I was I was chilling at this. When you lost your contacts, were you? Were you no, I was chilling at home alone playing FIFA. I went outside. And I think I took a wrong step and like blinking, blinking, boom, and then it fell. Oh, shame. Oh, yeah. Anyway, and uh, we are back, ladies and gentlemen. Happy New Year. Uh, welcome to 2020. 2020. It's a brand new year. It's a brand new decade. What is this year called? 2020 Vision. What is it? 2020 what? Plenty. 20, 20 plenty. 20 plenty. Yeah, yeah, I like that. Plenty, I don't plenty. know plenty of what, but plenty. Whatever plenty it is. of health, plenty of money. Yes, whatever that means, success to you, plenty of it. Plenty of you. I, I, uh, retina. retina. <laughs> 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 oh, oh good. So much, oh, for, this so much for, <laughs> so much for, like, this year is 2020, right? Yeah, and vision, you got no vision, and I don't have. You know, <laughs> there's no 2020 vision. Anyway, yeah, no. uh, before we chat about Chilean, man, um, how was your guys' December? Fuck, I actually mixed this, eh? The first you, week, you what? I missed this. Oh, you missed us. Yeah, it sounds like you said you mixed us. That's what I heard yeah. as well. <laughs> yeah, uh, but um, yeah, the first week was cool. Yeah, being on holiday, and then after that, I'm like, Damn nah, it. shit. Because <laughs> you've been on holiday the whole year, you're like, wait. <laughs> <laughs> but you were at home. That should have been like. No, home was amazing. Yeah, man. and the vendor was so nice to you. You went to, to vendor. Yeah, I was oh, in nice. vendor during the whole of December with my son. Oh, it was amazing. Oh wow. Like this, the the quality of life in vendor is is better than Joburg. Of course. I actually think if there wasn't a podcast, I'd I'd just go home and stay in vendor. Oh. I think yeah. m- most rurals. Mm. Mm. Oh, it was amazing, man. It was amazing. You didn't miss anything about the city and its rush and nothing. Nothing. Only How's thing the music that side? The music is the same. They were yeah, listening no. to uh, Makazi. Matorokis. Uh, Jerusalem. They were, yeah, Jerusalem. There was a lot of weddings. So that Coco. Coco. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Mm, yeah, yeah. Um, yeah. Umlilo. Yeah. But far enough, I didn't hear a lot of piano, actually. Is it? Yeah. yeah. Oh, okay. I heard piano at one party that I went to. But it was like an hour. Wow. Yeah. Probably so so you're saying piano is actually bigger this side, like Gauteng? It's big all over the country, but I think those songs Except I mentioned Devin. were, b- were Except bigger. Except because I'm just about to talk about Durban. Devin, well. it's not big. Ah, no. Uh, no. you kidding. No, I found out that's how people are stubborn. <laughs> but piano, like... What I are they listening to? Yeah, Shilem Shlop. They sing Goma. I think they listen to their own. Yeah. yeah. Uh, like Tira. And they're so s- and they're, and they're yeah. still really stuck on Gom. You know, Gom is so big that side. So so what song was the crossover in Durban? Probably Umlilo. But because of remember Ukozi FM, they couldn't now release um I mean do the twenty two that uh top twenty. But well, they didn't. Yeah, because there's some issues, some legal issues going on with the whole they couldn't do. So because you know it's a big factor yeah. that at twelve o'clock there's that in Goma. E. E. That place at yeah, 12. Yeah. That's yeah, the yeah. number one track. And it didn't. So, so where were you? What song did you hear? What song did I... I heard Zintle. They oh, were really Zintle. blasting Umlilo. Zintle where I was. Because I was by the beach front in Durban, actually. Oh. Yeah. And you? I was here at home. So I heard several piano songs. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. Uh, I was in Soweto. They played... Uh, Tula Nana. Oh, 
wow. To Lana, Lana. Yes, yes. That other one um was a prominent one. Uh kind of what is it? Ama Uba. Yes. Abantwana. Yes. Mm. Abantwana but Uba was a very prominent yeah. one. Which Where other were you, one? Lynn? I was sitting on my garden. Where? Yeah. Yeah, yes. Oh. Who does that on the thirty first? Wow. Dude, I'm old, bro. Yeah. <laughs> oh, yeah, you are. <laughs> you <old>. can't see. <laughs> Your retina is fucked. <laughs> I'm old. No. Y- you know you're old, ne? When you're chilling with people, right? And on the 31st slash on the 1st, like you chill the whole day, the whole day, whole day. 12 o'clock, hey, happy, happy. Pop bottles, pop bottles. Do cheers, 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 cheers. At 1 o'clock, everybody's passed out. Everybody was out. Yeah. Wow. I was the Shame. only one that stayed up, I think, until about four o'clock. Did you have, did you have firecrackers and stuff? No, no, no. I don't believe in those because they scare animals. Mm. Yeah. Like if you've seen an... Like animals die of heart attacks because of the noise that firecrackers make. Yeah. yeah. yeah so I don't... Well, peop- some people die. Did you see those guys <laughs> with the firecrackers? <laughs> Those, it's Pretoria <laughs> is a country by itself. Let's was that in Pretoria? Yes. Uh-huh. You could hear you the could chirping hear the, at the, the back. The, the like, hey, so like, <laughs> you know where you are. You know. Like, oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. oh gosh. But How anyway, was so it was cool, man. Uh, it was a jump. Like the uh, when uh, at midnight when the firecrackers went up, yeah. like all over Soweto, it was a beautiful sight. Nice. Yeah, it nice. was it was stunning. At least there was electricity. But we, it would have been nicer if there was no electricity. Why? Because I think we were going through the most, man. Yeah. What do you but mean? Anyway, it's, you were in Venda. That's why you don't care. <laughs> <laughs> you don't know. It's fine. <laughs> when do you guys come in Venda? Dude, you guys got to come. It's so, nice. hey, it's so uh, nice. Book has to, uh, to come to Venda. But you know what I realized when I was in Venda? Because my mom's been there, right? Um, so I hadn't seen in a while. So the first day... <laughs> the first day is nice. It's like, yo, my son, I haven't seen you. How's this? How's that? And then the second day... Uh, Cause she opened up like a a a, a, a butcher. Oh, okay. So they they also sell like popcorn and ice cream and stuff. Nice. A butchery. Yeah, a butchery. Yeah. yeah. So she asked me to run the popcorn machine. Okay. I'm like, do you know who the fuck I am? <laughs> I'm famous now. <laughs> oh, <laughs> eh? wow. What are my chillers gonna say? <laughs> yeah, you've got oil <laughs> and popcorn seeds in your hand. <laughs> No, hey, your mama was just trying to get you to pop as well. Yeah. <laughs> so like and she didn't give a end. fuck, dude. She wow. didn't care. So okay. there I was. <laughs> so in April. Yeah. <laughs> now you know the whole how to, Now you know how to run the popcorn machine. Yeah. You know how okay. to fill it up and all that mm-hmm. stuff. But it was podcast and popcorn. Yeah. Yes. It was. It was cool, man. So we can have the next chillers. We can operate the popcorn machine. Yeah. <laughs> the next parts. So you didn't go home as well. I did. So what I did was I went. There was a poiki at home on the 16th of December. So I drove out in the morning, went home, had the poiki, came back the following day. On Christmas morning, I went home, had a bri family thing, 26th, came back. Yeah, I think that's what I need to do. I need to go in and out. Mm. In and out. Yeah, go yeah. Friday, leave Sunday. <laughs> what are they still enjoying? Yes. I think that's the aim. Yes. Once you stay too long, then, you stay too long. then it's like, ah, you know what? The, the roof needs fixing. <laughs> <laughs> You'll be there on top of the roof, painting I'm, roof. Ah. Not yeah. about that life. But also as well, um, in what you're saying, ne? I personally missed my Wi-Fi, like all my comforts, like my my my, my fiber, my PlayStation, and 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 and, and just being mm. around my surroundings. I miss those. When I'm at home, it's what you are saying, like yeah, shop and um, yeah, can you fix the curtains? You know yeah, where to find mm, things, uh, mm, and you end up doing things that you ask yourself for, dude. But you know you could have done this way before I came, yeah. and it becomes annoying. Yeah. So it's like when you get home. Like they relive when you were still five years old, type of thing. Like, yes, yeah, and send getting sent. so I Become literally an just ice boy. in out. Yeah, is that operating popcorn machine? Mm. <laughs> Craziest thing is, uh, I get I wasn't with my woman because mm. she was in Rustenburg and uh, she wanted to bust a nut, uh, but I'm like, I can't pour her bit at home, <laughs> <laughs> it doesn't feel right. <laughs> On whose <laughs> on whose bed? <laughs> I didn't feel right, bro. <laughs> so you had to be strong. I had to be strong. Holidays, yeah. I had to be strong. I'm like, no, nah, this okay. doesn't feel right. <laughs> One can only my mom's in the other room. <laughs> <laughs> One can only imagine the first thing you did when you came to go. <laughs> oh gosh. Anyway, uh, so that was December. Yeah. Uh, where were you when you heard about Chilean, bro? 
Somebody called me actually in the morning, eight mm. o'clock on or seven o'clock. He's like, dude, um, did you hear about Chile? I'm like, mm. what about Chile? Mm. He's like, no, I think uh, Chile has passed on. I was like, dude, what are you talking about? But I'm in sleep. Yeah, you know, yeah, yeah. Like, yeah. Mm. Like, what are you talking about? He's like, no, 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 dude. Like I saw McMillan Mul Mac no 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 McFarlane Mulele. Yeah. I tweeted it. Mm. Oh shame. I'm like, okay, whatever, dude. So I go on Twitter, look at trends map. People are talking about World War Three. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh. I'm like, I okay, this guy is lying. I'll go back to bed. Yeah. And then I get calls from our close friends mm. that knew and worked with him. I'm like, hey, did you hear? I'm like, guys, no, I don't know. Mm. I only found out or I only started believing it when an article on the citizen and there was a news broadcast on Newsroom Africa mm. that was saying oh, that this happened. Wow. Before then, I was like, nah, you guys are talking nonsense. Like, no. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah, yeah. Because it was like, no, but like, no, no. Yeah. Like, what do you mean? Yeah. Mm. So, yeah, that's pretty much how I found Oh, I and I tried to call you, but your phone was off. Yeah, it's pretty much what happened with me as well. Because I was sleeping and then I woke up. I woke up to like a lot of texts mm. and tweets. People were asking, is this true? Is this true? Yeah. I'm like, ah, no, there's no ways. Mm. Don't, daddy's a rock star. Mm. There's yeah. no ways. Uh, and then I called Neo Lusenga, mm. and she wasn't sure as well. Mm. So she made a couple of calls. She called, I think, Mpulo and a couple of his friends and the sister and whatnot. Oh. And then, yeah, she called me back a few hours later to confirm that, yeah, no, it is. It is wow. true. Mm. But at first, I, I was like, nah, this can't be real. Yeah. Even me, it was like, it came out of the, came out of the blue. I'm like, but like, it's the second of Jan or the third of Jan. No, like it's too soon to start playing pranks because also you must understand somebody tweets something on social media, right? Yeah. There's a lot of pranking that goes, goes on. on. Mm. So you can't just take things for what somebody puts there. Yeah. yeah. So I was like, no, this is another joke. It's fine. Went back to sleep, did what I did, read those funny American tweets about World War Three, and then, and then only when other people started calling me and stuff, I was like, no, but even still, I was like, no, man. Me too, bro. It only sunk in when, yeah. when, when YFM called me because uh, DJ Sabi called um, since I did the last interview with Udid yeah. to find out, you know, how was it? Boom, 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 boom. Yeah. Only after that interview, I was like, damn, this guy's gone. He's gone. You know what I mean? Yeah. Because it's dead. It dude. became too close to home because of the interview that we just, and we, how we talk about this guy all the time. Yeah. No, we can't be RIP him. And now. I think, and I think beyond the, beyond the interview, right? And it's what he said. <clears throat> he was he was a teacher to a lot of us. Yeah, mm. yeah, yeah, mm. yeah. He was a teacher to a lot of us. Mm. And he wasn't stingy about information. Like if you wanted to learn, he would give He'll you. He'll teach you. He'd teach you. You know, nice. Because there's some people that like. Uh, yeah, they don't really want to show you. Yeah, yeah. yeah they yeah. do seminars just to give away information you don't have to now do you a to, seminar just to, to pay for it yeah. and the thing is with chilean right a lot of people will say a lot of things about chilean yeah. um i don't know him like personally because it was always during work mm. that we interacted so chilean the, the 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 guy i think like you know he had demons like we, we all do, all do. Course, we all do yeah. you know what i mean yeah chilean the broadcaster was Fuck it, it was on another level. Uh, yeah. I don't care what anybody says. Ne? Yeah. Whoever listened to Chili, whoever uh, spoke with him, whoever like I don't know, learned yeah. from him. Learned from him. Yeah. Dude, Chili was the greatest, or if not one of the greatest. Yeah. I think he's on par with Fat Joe. I'm not too sure who is mm. the greatest between him and Fat Joe, but he's up there. Yeah. Well, yeah, that's, I that's think a, he's up there. Yes. Yeah. The shit he used to do. <laughs> crazy. Chili was crazy, guys. <laughs> You know I think I, you guys, from a a a, 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 persp a a point where you were actually working with him, there yeah. was another level. But I think as a listener to the show, I used to, I still, like, if I remember the chills, I, do, I can't exactly remember because obviously I was younger. Yeah. But I just there was this excitement about listening to him yeah. with De, um Deneo. Deneo, So yeah. I, I I I still say oh, you know what man. he's the best. Daddy, daddy, show me life. Yeah, daddy, yeah, daddy. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. You know what was my favorite? Um, <laughs> The favorite thing that Chili M used to do, I know there's your slash puppies yeah. and being sent to the underground parking <laughs> that you denied vehemently. <laughs> My favorite was when he walked, when YFM was still at uh, Rosebank, right? Yeah, yeah. Uh, he would walk in through the doors at my Ama Keep Keep, dragging this bag over there. He had this uh, this bag that had wheels. Okay. So he would come dragging that bag. About 10 past 3, his show is already 10 minutes on. What? He's not rushing to the studio. He goes to the fridge in the kitchen 
takes the milk in the fridge and then just drinks it like that. And the the, the lady who used to clean at YFM always used to have a fight with Chili. Like, hey, wait a Chili. What are you doing? It's like, oh, what was her name? Mom? Ah, oh, mom, mom, I forgot her name. Oh, I know, I know. Yes, know. yes. yes. It's like, hey, wait a Chili. Eating is like, ah, oh, mom, man, I need my, I need my uh, protein. Yeah. I need my protein, man. <laughs> For go, go in the studio and then magic Jovic would come. Ah, oh, dude, oh. that guy. You know, that's actually how that whole, you know that whole thing that trended that I did back then? The whole blinging and, 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 and you're not blinging and whatnot. Uh, Remember yeah, that prank uh, that uh, I did? Um, I the uh, gold, gold digger, digger yes. Uh-huh. Remember that gold digger prank? Uh-uh. You don't know it. You don't know the gold digger Remind prank. Me. Ah, Remind I me. I must play it for you. Okay. That whole, you're not blinging and whatever. So how that came about is I was standing in for chili. Okay. And I knew when I was standing in for chili, when you sit in that seat, ne, you know, like, fuck. All of Joe Berg is listening. listening. So you got to bring the heat. Yeah, yeah. Oh, and so I'm like, what can I do? What can I do? And then while I was there, I thought about it. Boom, boom, boom. And then we did it. And then uh, luckily it landed. But like, I, I've stood in for a lot of people. But when you stand in for Chili, Chili. you can tell because Harry 3, the lines are like this already. <laughs> you haven't said this shit. shit. <laughs> <laughs> you could feel, bro. And I remember there was this one time. Um, I've never told anybody this, actually. Uh, the, we, we, uh, it was me and my wheelies, I think. We're in the other studio, Studio B in Rosebank. So we're just fucking around doing some pranks. So there's this other guy from News. He was part of Ground Zero. He had a deep, deep voice. Oh, you have to actually tell the story. Told have I told you the story? <laughs> yes. yeah. the, daddy the, minute you, the, min- the minute you mentioned Vex. Yeah. His yes. name is Vex. He had yes. a deep daddy voice. One. The daddy one. Yeah, he had a deep voice. He's like, you know, like, hey. he's like big brother voice. Yeah. 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 Okay. So we call him my boy. So the, I told him that he must call, like, why we're going to call YFM um, DJs, <laughs> and then he must say he's their father. Who I want. So we call him for my boy. He's like, hey, my boy, uh, I just wanted to tell you, uh, I'm your father. And he's just like, hey, are you serious? <laughs> wow. How come I didn't know of this? Blah, blah, blah. But she was very, like, chilled about it. Then we call more flavor. Hey, more flavor. Hey, I'm your father. Serious. <laughs> But this joke is funny every time every you tell time it. You tell it. <laughs> and then he's like, eh, so where have you been? You know? He starts getting curious. Like yeah. he's starting to believe this guy or his shit. <laughs> this is his father. So eventually he goes, uh, okay, can we meet Monday? <laughs> you know, let's chat. <laughs> because I've got a father so who I thought with that taco. <laughs> yeah. The original. <laughs> basically. <laughs> you know. One. But basically he was like believed it. Well, well, and then we called Chile. We're like, Chile, hey, I'm your father. Ah, oh, t- t- your, 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 your son is famous. <laughs> <laughs> your son is famous, Ted. <laughs> <laughs> I am the daddy. <laughs> yeah. And I never played those, those pranks on it because Mo Flavor was pissed. Oh, shit. He was so pissed. Because oh. after that, we called him back. We're like, yo, that was a prank. He's <laughs> like, don't ever fucking do that. If you play that <laughs> shit, I'll fuck you up. <laughs> So I never got to play it on air, but oh, it was so shit. funny, man. <laughs> and that's the kind of guy Chili was. He was very chilled, man. Very like chilled. Every time I think about it, it was good times. And yeah. whenever you were Chili, you laughed. Nice. There's so many things he did in air that I could tell you that, yes, I need like the whole day. Bro. Stylish Aww. man as well. Like, he, he went, he went to, we work on radio, right? Yeah. But he would walk in there looking like he's going to the mat. Nice. Like he, he, you know, he no, ch- no, no, Chili dressed up. Because I was his technical producer, okay. so no matter whatever is going on in his private life, yeah. um, pff, whatever happens is yeah. happening, right? But when he switched on that mic, mm. <laughs> he made love. To that that mm. that was like it was chilly at his best. Yeah. When that mic was on, yeah. Fuck me, you do things. I'll be like, how the hell does this guy think of mm. this? Until this day, I haven't heard that shit on radio. Yeah, man. yeah. He did say it's dead. Yo, yo, yo. Remember the 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 the, 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 the three hour link? Mm. You know the three hour link? No. You can hear it. The three hour link. Serious? You don't no, know. No, 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 no. I think you meant you're explaining it wrong. The three hour story. The three hour story. Yes. Okay. You don't link. know. No. Oh my goodness, let me tell you. So you're standing in for DJ Spoo. DJ mm-hmm. Spoo was doing breakfast. Yeah. So that's six uh, AM to nine AM. Okay. So he goes in there. Normally at like half past six, that's when they do traffic and sports and whatever. So he's like, yo, guys, you won't believe what happened yesterday. Yo, fucking hell. <laughs> well, he didn't say fuck, but he yeah. said, like, yo, what a crazy night. He, and then the uh, Faith, Faith was the ghost. Mm. She's like, what happened there? He's like, I'll tell you after, after sports. <laughs> <laughs> 
So like for the first hour from six until seven, yeah. he's laying the foundation of the story. Yeah. But basically from six until nine, he was telling uh, the story about how he um, went out last night, took some drugs, um, had sex without a condom. Yeah. And you know, all these crazy things yeah. are happening between six and nine. So you tell a little bit, and then he's like, hey, let me play traffic. <laughs> then go to traffic, <laughs> play songs. Come back, add to the story. story. But the whole premise of the story was like drugs, yeah. women. Oh, so to add to that, in between, he would call like friends, his mom, and, and, and. To be like, hey, you won't, you won't believe what happened to me last night. Yo. Yeah. So that sort of like gave the story meat on some like, okay, Chili, like what's going on? So now, got seven, eight o'clock, everybody's like, Panicking, yeah. though. Everyone in Joburg was listening that day because everyone's like, "How the fuck can this guy talk about taking drugs on air?" On air. The the programs manager's like, "Chili, what are you doing?" Yeah. You know what I mean? I remember Tato was even uh, late for work because yeah. people were glued to the radio to hear where the story is going to end. Yeah. It comes at nine a.m. So at nine a.m. he has to go straight into news. Got yeah. nine. So this is his last link. He's like, "Yeah." So that's what happened. And then guess what? I woke up and I realized it was all a dream. Drop that fucking thing of yours. <laughs> That's it. Bah! News done. Show done. People were listening from 6 until 9 a.m. Yeah. Oh, no, that's dead. It was all a dream. And then he, he played Big, you know? Mm. Yeah, it was all a dream. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wow. Oh, that is but you see, the thing with him yeah. is... Uh, <coughs> Because I remember with the, the 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 knowledge that I took from him, like the one thing that stands out from what he did, it's something that he called the Mexican bicycle. I don't know if you know about it. Yeah. So telling a story from six until nine o'clock. TSL yeah. time spent yes. listening. Yeah. He was basically doing the Mexican bicycle. He understood that Jobert gets up at six, and they are on the road at seven o'clock to go to work. Mm -hmm. So I need them yeah, seven from to seven o'clock mm. okay. to eight o'clock. Mm. So that is the key moment when I have to get to the meat, meat of, of the, the story. story. Mm. And then once I have them there, they are hooked mm. and then I can carry them from eight to nine. Yeah. Oh, nice. That's basically what he did. Imagine so he hearing that. the foundation at six. Yes. yes. From six ah, to, six from six six to, to seven. seven. Yeah. He was teasing. He teasing. was teasing. Yeah. Mm. And, then and then seven, seven to eight, eight he meat. gives you the meat mm -hmm. and then you're like, now you're hooked. Oh, now, now you're, you're hooked. hooked. Mm. You want to hear Eight more. to nine, he drags you a little bit, a little bit, a little bit, a little bit until nine and then he just leaves you. Basically <laughs> Imagine doing a show after that. <laughs> <laughs> Ask him, man. Oh, no, it was from my boy at the time. No, it was I'm the Monage <laughs> Oh, and then there's this other one. So, so he was giving away um, a trip to the Grand Prix in Monaco or something. Oh. Yeah. So he's giving away a trip to Monaco, right? So he's calling the winner. So he calls the winner uh, his house number. Calls the house number. The wife answers. So he's like, hey, upu Jabu. Mm -hmm. Ah, the wife's like, no, Jabu's not here. He's at work. He's like, ah, cool. We're calling to, um, you know, uh, announce that he's won the prize yeah. to go to Monaco, you know? Mm -hmm. So do you know where he is? She's like, no, he's at work. He's like, all right, cool. Give us the phone number. Mm -hmm. And then let's call him at work. Cool. So he's like, actually, because you're the wife, why don't you hang on the line as well? Yeah. So we surprise him together, but yes. don't say anything. Yes. Okay. So he calls the guy. The guy's at work. He calls he's like, hey. Jabu, how are you? This is Chili M. We're calling to let you know you've won. Yeah, you know the whole effect. Of yeah. yeah, congratulations. Woo. Woo. And then he's like, so Jabu, who are you going to bring to, because uh, you've got a plus one, who are you going to take with to Monaco? And then Jabu's like, ah, I'm going to take with to And the wife's like, hey, Jabu, I'm going to take This was true. Oh my God. No, it was planned. It was, it was planned. planned. It was bland, okay. you know. <laughs> but when you when we when we heard it for the first time, like that's when you like turn up the volume because now <laughs> the woman is shitting on the guy and the guy is like, eh? Hey? And then she is like, ah, oh, dead. <laughs> <laughs> Explain yourself. <laughs> oh, oh man, gosh, I know. He, ah, no. he really knew how to get people hooked, dude. Yeah, oh, shame. Oh. Ah, no, he was amazing. He was amazing. Yeah, nah. Uh, Radio won't be the same like that. No, nah, it never was again. actually after yeah. he left mainstream radio. Truth be told. So we've had these conversations many a time. Mm. You had the conversation with him as well. Yeah. Yeah. Well, and I watched the the, the interview because I hadn't watched it since that, that 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 day. Since you edited. 
Yeah, since I edited. Yeah. Yeah. I watched it back. That interview is crazy, eh? <laughs> 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 now now you understand. You, 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 you understand. <laughs> And had I known it would be the last interview, I think we could have done like two, two hours, hours, bro. Two hours, yeah. You know, because there was a lot he wanted to say. Imagine. And Imagine. his sister called me today. They want me to speak at his memorial. Oh. But I'm, I'm so bad with crowds, man. It's not about, it's not about crowds. Yeah, it's not about me, actually. It's, it's, it's not about you. Yeah. yeah. When is the memorial? Uh, Wednesday. On Wednesday. And then In the funeral is Friday, eh? Friday. Yeah. Yeah. But at least I'll be speaking with Daniel Lusenga. Because she was his producer. Hey, she's driving yeah. crazy. <laughs> <laughs> but she's the one person who knew how to deal with him. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah. Oh. yeah. Actually, funny enough, the first time I went on air on commercial radio, YFM, 2008, September, mm-hmm. it was on the Essential Rush. Yeah, didn't you do your first bulletin on the Yes, yeah. on Chile And you're doing the sports? Yes. Mm. And he dragged me. What did he like, say? He's <laughs> Remember when I was still in the Y Academy and remember there was we used to do ground zero and you used to call us book zero. Conzero. It's like Conzero <laughs> Funanla. I'm like, no, I'm doing sports. He's like, yo, 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 yo. Like, I right, let's see. Yeah. And yeah. Oh nice. Yeah. Anyway, what's been happening in the world, man? What's been happening? World War Three. Yeah, what's World going three? on? Has it started? <laughs> we go for one week, there's World oh. War Three. I can early December. <laughs> December. Trump was impeached, right? No. So yeah, yeah, he, he was impeached. He was impeached, but mm. what th- then? What, what did the voting went against him? Mm-hmm. But I don't think he was impeached. He was impeached. He was impeached. Okay, what does impeaching a president mean? Like you've been removed. No, no, no they, they they impeached him, but then they had to rule again to remove him. Oh. Yeah. And okay. then I stopped watching. I don't know what yeah. happened after that. Okay, I thought. It got he to but he was impeached. Yeah. yeah, he was impeached. I just remember the votes happening. I yeah. don't remember hearing that he was impeached. No, there's or another ma- process for them to remove, remove him. Remove, yes, oh. yeah. So is it you impeach a president, and then is it now up to the... Kana, is he a, he's not a Democrat, right? He's a Republican. Republican, yeah. Yes. Republican. So is it now up to the Republicans to get rid of him? Or is it still within the Senate to get rid of him? It's still within the Senate. Correct me if I'm wrong. I don't know I, much I, about I don't know. Shit, but I think yeah. it's with American the politics. I don't know. Yeah. It's, it's, it's so complex. Much I think that's why I actually like lost interest. I'm and then World War Three. Do you know about that? That happened because kind of who's a guy? I forgot his name. The, uh, Iran. the Iran military head type of thing mm-hmm. died in Bach, was it Baghdad, somewhere in mm. the east, uh, from an American strike. Okay. Mm. And Iran were like probably like ah. And then guys, what are you doing? Mm. And then Trump was like. If you want to come at us, come at us, Papa. She can't she. And you now they are coming. <laughs> are they? <laughs> well, uh, no, the troops have have left. Have left. They went. They were. I saw images showing that troops actually now leaving. Can we run. speak on the mic in 2020? Uh, <laughs> Do you know what really? Trump tweeted two two days ago or yesterday? Because uh, you know he loves Twitter. Like, Oof. my God, Oof. I think somebody must take away his phone. He said. Uh, well, this was obviously his threat to the Iranian people and the Iranian government that if you guys want to go to war, come, let's go. We have just bought three trillion, <laughs> three trillion U.S. dollars worth of ammunition and we are itching to use it. <laughs> oh, <laughs> my. Hey, Trump like, is that's crazy. a whole tweet. That came yes, from Trump. He tweeted that. Mm. Trump is crazy. I don't right? understand that, man. I don't know. And America. the sad thing about it is... It's Do you think he thinks on radio? TSL. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Camp's been reading. I think he thinks like, he's on... Like, Yo, bruv. Like, he's hooking us. Yeah, <laughs> like this is the meat right now. <laughs> I didn't even think he would last this long. Yeah. Neither did I. Neither did I, bro. And there's like... I think elections are next year, November. No, this year, November. Yes. This year, November, yeah. But Americans are just bullies in general, man. When it comes to war. Well, they've got the money. They've got the money. Yeah. War is the, about Wasn't their country built on war, though? It wasn't it? There wasn't a country built on war. No, wasn't America built on war? Mm, yeah, people fought each other for America to exist. Remember the Boston Tea Party? Mm. Yes, it was... Yeah, it was built on war. Yeah. Anyway, what else has been happening? Yes, I wasn't even on social media, eh? We've the had whole of December. Yeah, dude. Yo, oh. I dabbled here and there, but I was... We there. had... We had... We had... Load shading is back. Because mm. somebody forgot to cover the coal. That's <laughs> 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 Now, didn't they say it's because the guy is back on leave? 
No, that's the, the, the switcher. No. <laughs> he's, he's back though. Everyone came back to work. He came back on Saturday. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> so, uh, shit, speaking cool. about load shedding, I used to do this thing every year when I was on radio. Mm-hmm. I used to do a feature called What Do You Think Was So Whatever Year It Was We Just Ended. Oh. Load shedding is not in that list. I'll <laughs> tell you that right now. <laughs> so let, let's do our own list. Let's start our own list now. What do you think is so 2019? 2019. Yes. Oh. For me, Lama Tuanaba Uba, I cannot stand that song. I think my, you know, my piano slips differently when <laughs> it's like when you have to go to work. Yeah. You know, in December, ne, when I was going to work, I'm about 12, 13, da. In the morning, do, 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 do. <laughs> it was nice. Now, when you go to work, in your news headlines, <laughs> what changed? Like what changed? <laughs> but it's also true. I, I I I think I was bumping piano in my car, in the house, wherever I was. Ne? Yeah. Nice. Ever since the second of Jan, I haven't listened to one piano song voluntarily. No, I've still been listening to piano, but that Uber song I've heard it too many times. times. If I hear it one more time, I'm gonna slip my wrist, dude. Or you're just gonna <laughs> take a Uber. <laughs> You know what happened? I think like a week last week, my friends were going out, and I'm like, you know what? I'm tired of listening. I'm tired of going out. You hear the same music, and because you start demanding piano, and you know the tracks are gonna come. Yeah. You're gonna get excited. Same dance moves, same yeah. craziness. I'm like, you know what? I'm tired. I'm good. I yeah. don't wanna go out. Last week Friday, I was like, I'm, I'm, I'm like. I can't. I can't. <laughs> Uber. It's like you've Ubered out. Yo, you? dude. Oh, wow. yo. Now, Pori, did you see the Poi, poi yo, Sawa? Poi yo, 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 yo. That's crazy. I've never seen that. You and drop a song sh- within hours, it trends. Exactly. Ah, I've never seen uh, that. Yeah, yeah. Drop nah, the nah, fucking nah, nah. thing of yours. Shout out to <laughs> fucking Pori, man. <laughs> fucking hell. But also, some of my Pori is wow. But, but they built the, the hype to the song was built up very nicely. Though. Yeah, yeah. Because remember, They're just like a Chilean thing kind yes, of thing. That was on online, though. Yeah. Yeah. Oh. Chili M effect. Uh, so the guy, the the knocking guy yes. with the video, please Found find him. me this guy. Yeah. Find the guy. We've got okay, him. We've got him. We are guys, cooking the song. We are cooking the song. Ah, we need Kespa in your vest. Yes. Kespa, no. I don't want to be on the song because people say this and this and this. <laughs> Next thing, he's on the song. Next thing, they even put that little kid. What's his name? But the little kid. Yes. On the song? No, no, not on the actual song. Yeah. I think on the whole thing. Oh. Uh, Junior. The junior DJ man. What's oh, junior, as junior. Ju- yes, and then he comes, tweets like, "Ah, can I have a, a one that does not have swearing in it?" <laughs> <laughs> and then Aww. they and then they make it, and then yeah, that's the lifespan of the of the of the thing. No, that's nice. just fucking smart. Yeah, Mark fucking genius. Smart. It's like they yeah. just kept us going for January, you know. And the song is huge. I've heard it like ten times since yeah. since uh, the beginning of the year. Yeah, it's huge. It's massive. It's huge. Mm. It's huge. Imagine what it's like. And there was a challenge. People seeing cops and going, hey, yeah, poisa. Poisa. Hey, but that one me. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm busy. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, no, no. <laughs> I didn't deal with them in December. Yes. I have no desire to deal with Not even December. In 20, what's the last year? 2019. 2019? Yeah. I have no desire to deal with them this year. 2019, when I was driving to Vend, I was drinking nano alcoholic. Yeah. So uh, they had a roadblock. Mm-hmm. So I'm drinking my nano alcoholic mm-hmm. <laughs> within the roadblock. <laughs> So this one cop sees me from there. Yeah. He <laughs> the enthusiast. Yeah. He runs like, hey, wait. So I stop. He stops me. He's like, you're drinking. I'm like, no, this is non alcoholic. He couldn't believe it. He couldn't believe it. Did he want to taste it even? Yeah. He ended up tasting it. Wow. He didn't believe but it. But then, if you taste it, it doesn't taste that far off oh. from alcoholic. Mm. So how can you tell how if it's a real tell? thing or not? Yeah. But I. Because worst case scenario is they're going to take your blood and they're not going to find alcohol exactly. in it. But it was funny, man. <laughs> <laughs> you gave, you Watching him run. <laughs> he got there. I'm sure he was like, I've got it. <laughs> like, curb your enthusiasm type of thing. Anyway, can you guys imagine mm-hmm. what it's like to have the biggest song in the country? I've always wanted that. The phone Mapuri Sabe. Hey? Phone Mapuri. Like everywhere in the world. I mean, everywhere in the country. Everyone's playing a song. Imagine yeah. what that feels like. I, I think that's better than sex, good. man. I don't know. I would, I've, I've had one. I have never had the one. So I. But what do you think that feels like? It's probably like being the biggest thing in the country. Exactly. Or being like the main actor of the biggest soapy in the country. Us DJs in there as well. Oh, that DJ's song Lilo was very big, you know? You go to weddings, everybody. So I think like I'm sleeping when, 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 when God is dishing out hits. Yeah. Like Zintli, here's a hit. Gabza, here's a hit. <laughs> 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 My poor reason. 
<laughs> or maybe you must work with Pori. Then maybe you'll get. Ah, married. it's too busy for it's me. Too yeah, busy. it's too busy. Well, you have time uh, for faith and Getty. You know. Ah, it's too busy. I mean, even if I call him now, he won't answer. He's a b- busy man. No, 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 leave him. He's got. He's, he's finishing off the last of his uh sixty. What was it? Seventy nine or eighty nine gigs? He still has gigs now. Let's call him. He probably won't live in London. I doubt it's too busy. Voice mate. He's probably got a gig now. Probably going to Perhaps some people haven't ended December in it. Some people are still December. Yes, I'm on leave. Yeah. I wonder if you guys can hear it. I, I'll never answer. But that'd be a dope song. What happened to a podcast song? You were still ah. with people had gigs. Oh, oh, yes. Yeah, yeah. So it'll make it for uh, the summers. Mm, the summers. <laughs> <laughs> we'll submit. Anyway, so what do you guys think is so 2019? I think, what is that? Some S- fashion trends. S- Seba Wheelie, or what do you call it? Oh, oh I still it's don't know what that means. <laughs> it's, it's a ball. It's, it's a, a cra- ball. <laughs> it's, a, it's yeah. a crave. It's like a crave. Oh, yeah, basically. Yeah, like I'm craving. Yeah. I'm craving a hit. Yeah. Yes. <laughs> so <laughs> You are so balling a hit. <laughs> <or something Yes. laughs> like is it, I stand to be corrected, uh, is it Seba Wheelie or Soba Wheelie? It's a Kosa word. Kosa word. Yes. Oh, okay. Yeah, 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 that is so yes. 2019. I yeah. agree. You go, lady. I, I think all this uh, colorfulness. Colorfulness. These colorful trends could be the colorful hair. The and I'm no. I need to show my Josie. My like my Josie style. Yeah. Oh, okay. And I've got blue and green braids, so I, I'm, I'm really feeling bad. I can't be. I'm colorblind. Everything is black. <laughs> <laughs> you colorblind right now. <laughs> oh shit. Well, to dark colors. Uh, yes. Okay. So you can't see me. Because <laughs> <laughs> you are dark. <laughs> Drop that fucking thing of yours. <laughs> oh, You're hating on dark skin. Now. No, that's not fair. Color's nice, man. We no, need some color, color in good, our lives. But I'm just saying, you know, you get these neon fashion trends. Yeah. And, yeah. Would you ever dye your hair blonde? No way. Ne? Never. Why yeah. not? You know, no. I'm not, I love dyeing my hair. I yes, love. yo. You see, you, there are certain things that work with certain people. Oh, and okay. Th- like, imagine MacGyver with the Casper in your vest, one color blonde, one color black. Make G, would you? Never. Why not? Nah, it's, it's just look. I I wouldn't be comfortable. Oh, sure. It, it's, it reeks seeking attention. Yes. Oh. To yes. me, that's what it. That's what it does. Okay. I, I don't think. I would what about those follow trains things? Which ones? Follow. Like retweet follow back. this and follow back. I don't do. I've never been into those. No, I'm saying they should stay in 2019. Mm. Oh, okay. And the nah. people that do them <laughs> should stay in. 2019. But let's not talk about them. <laughs> Who's them? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Asikola. Yeah. <laughs> Let those <laughs> follow trains are annoying, bruh. <laughs> do they actually work, though? I don't, I don't know. know. I've never done those. I think they do, actually. Because I've seen the people who do it. Every time somebody does that, you'll see like they're sitting on like 17, 18,000 followers. Followers. And, then and just so the number of followers triples. you have, if it's in correlation to the number of people you follow, then you are part of the follow train. Yeah. For mm. me. Yes. So if you've got 18,000 followers, but you follow 17,000 people, you are follow train. Yeah, follow yeah. train. Yeah. <laughs> I love the way you say follow train. <laughs> <laughs> follow train. That's but the is the type. <laughs> yeah. That's where you are. Oh, yeah, shit, man. Please follow me on Instagram. I'm trying to get to 10,000. Follow it? train. <laughs> follow train. <laughs> Drop and that fucking uh, thing of yours. I mean, follow back, man. <laughs> I'm trying to get to 10,000 so I can make my account a business account. Oh. Then when I upload episodes, people can just swipe up. For the oh, link. For the link. Instead of yes. link in bio. bio. <laughs> <laughs> kind of what else did I think must stay in 2019? Shame. Being broke. <laughs> well, yeah, obviously. <laughs> yeah, but can we stop the whole thing that I don't I don't have a job? I think we over I don't have a job did. Who started it? Who started no, it? I'm just saying. But who said it today? Yes. No, I'm just saying. But who said who it today? 2010. Can unemployment stay in 2019? Okay. Because now you've got a job. Yeah, this is my job, clearly. Okay, all right. <laughs> <laughs> I, I, didn't say, I didn't say anything. <laughs> so, from now on, I'm an, I am self-employed. Yeah, okay, you are self-employed. Yeah. Ta-ta. No more b- jobless jokes. Jo- yeah, okay. okay. Yeah. No more unemployment jobs. Yeah. Okay, okay cool. Yeah. Yeah. That's fine. Um, um, but I was never into that. I was didn't jump on the train. Ah, Len, you want us to bring, um, uh, bring <laughs> no, up no, the no. fire? Last year, of course, yes. <laughs> no, I was there. Oh, yeah. I, I was on your pay sleep there. <laughs> <laughs> the invincible one. Yeah, but <laughs> now I'm chilled. Oh, yeah, I'm chilled. not there anymore. Yeah. No? Mm. Kind of what else did I? Th- so what's redundant? Uh, redundant this year. So 2019. Yeah. What's so 2019? Uh, yeah. I was thinking about something. No, 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 man. Um, cloud chasers. Cloud chasers. Ah, those yeah. will never die. Nah. Mm, those will yeah. never die. As long okay, as. Okay. Describe a, a cloud chaser now. Someone who does something for cloud. Yeah. 
Mm. Okay, for example, what's the latest example that you can say that was serious cloud chasing? Someone who dyes their hair blonde. Ha. <laughs> <laughs> Drop that fucking thing of yours. <laughs> I'd say all these celebrities now doing like booty shots. Oh, that's cloud chasing. It's January. People no, but they do have cloud. They want, they want to stay relevant. I I've only like seen two though. No, oh, that's I don't uh, know. So Nadia Nakai and Boiti. No, yeah. Oh, so Nadia probably started. Who else was there? Uh, who else? Oh, Tando Tabuti. Tando Tabuti. Mm. 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 Ah, there's a host of them. But if you go to <laughs> some people call it Tando No Booty. <laughs> <laughs> How did what how, how, what happened there? <laughs> no, she she, got, she got a booty and a half. There. No, but those people are cloud chasing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. You see? yeah. Mm. haters. But ah, if you go to Instagram, that's there, so it's never gonna go away. Yeah. It's all that's like always what you go to King Explore. Mm. That's what you see all the time. Mm. So it's okay, people must just be what they are. It's fine. It's yeah. the norm. Mm. Yeah. What else? Um, mm. Can my piano cross over? Ah, piano's life, dog. Okay, cool. Piano's life. Oh, it's piano's fine. life. Mm. I don't know how many times I listened to that song, Tender Love, by Pori, Pori and Gabs. Oh, oh and Shasha. Song's beautiful. Yeah. yeah. That song's oh. beautiful. Oh, no. Mm. I just love Shasha right now as well. Mm. She's just... She's amazing, man. Oh. Where did she come from? I know she's from Zim. She's from Zim, man. Mm. Yeah. She just came out of nowhere. She just came out of nowhere. Mm. And actually, so... How uh, come people don't respect my Poriza? They I don't. think they do. Nah. Not Why? like black coffee. <sighs> but I think, you know what? I think maybe sometimes we look down on our... It's crowd, crowd. Uh, uh, until you have achieved, like, overseas, then it's like we make you a person. He did a song with Drake. What do you mean? Mapori song. Yes. Yeah, he did. But I guess because he's Drake not playing never... In, he's not playing in Ibiza. Yeah, he's not... Oh, it's not like I was in the Beyonce USA. Beyonce used one of his songs. Yeah. During it, a, uh, uh, a Lion King, eh? no, 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 no. During um, Insta Story or whatever, she used Nai Lewok. Oh, mm. oh, yeah, yes, Nai mm. Lewok. Yeah, I remember. What would that. it take for Pori? <laughs> no, but he's, he's, he's getting his respect, but nah, I just think we no, look at him his, from the no, point get, of view he's, that he's sh- getting his gigs. Like, yeah, you he's know, there's a, point whereby, there's a point whereby a fame is not there's money and there's respect. Yeah, I, I people th- don't respect no, Pori. I, I think amongst his peers, there's respect. Yeah. The riffraff can go to hell. Yeah. Do you think maybe it's because he's not um, boxed to one genre? Like coffee, you know, coffee's deep tech, deep house, yeah, boom, boom, yeah, boom. Yeah. And then and Pori will do, um, will do my piano, he will do... But Cleo, was, but Cleo was respected and he was also multidimensional. Was Cleo respected? I think he was. Cleo? Yes. Cleo as was pro- respected. As a producer, yes. No, to people that adore and love music, yes. Yes, I think he was. But to the masses? Yes. Do you reckon? Yes, I think DJ Cleo was. I, I say him and Pori are the same WhatsApp group. Actually, oh, I, Cleo. I would say mm. maybe Cleo was w- uh, a, a bit more respected. No, Cleo was respected, mm. bro. Yeah. He was. Yeah. Oh, and he made quiet or hip hop. Ah, he did everything. It, like. I think maybe with my Pori, some people just don't know where to place him. That's what I'm saying. Yeah. But but can't he just be, he's a fucking dope it's producer. Okay, dope. let me ask you this. <coughs> ne? That's where it ends. Before his productions via piano now came to prominence, did people actually take notice of Maporis? Mm. Of course not. Not necessarily. S- yes. So, he comes now with Gabza. Mm-hmm. They wreak havoc. Yeah. People are like, ah, oh, okay, Gabza, he's my piano call. We know him. Ah, Pori. Nah, mm, mm, mm. As time goes, now they know about him. Ah, dude, this guy is was part of Uhuru. He did that whole album, Yama Figizol. The one with Corner. Okay, how many people know that? A lot That's of people. Adams, no. Oh, he did Uhuru as well. Yes. You didn't oh, know did you, that. Did you know I that? He was part of Uhuru. He I'm did Zintle's first big hit, My Name Is. That was Pori's song. Are you serious? Yes. But oh, wow. How many this people are preview to this exactly. information that you have? I don't know. Not everybody knows. Hence, I'm saying, it's like... I just thought he popped up guy now in Lewok. I thought he's that guy. <laughs> like, seriously. I thought... <laughs> Bon, and how long was uh, my name is between my name is and yeah, my name walk. is probably a good seven hour eight he, years and that's the difference yeah he did a song with Drake two years ago guys yeah I know yeah but know. he just produced he ah. produced and maybe what's Drake? the name of the song uh, I forgot the yeah. name that's but it was a big song man it was a big mm. song it was one of the singles okay mm. yeah but anyway shit what else did I want to talk about 
What else did you want to talk about? What do you want to leave behind in 2018, 2019? Being broke. <laughs> that's all. <one. laughs> no, you mentioned something. Oh, that's subsequent to that. I don't know which. You did mention something. Please about. record that. <laughs> oh, wow. You and you, Ghost Lady, what are you leaving in 2019? What am I leaving in 2019? Mm, hopefully, <laughs> not your husband, because we like him. <laughs> we like him on the podcast. I can't leave the marriage, eh? <laughs> No, no, I'm so good. Hey, my girl made me watch Why I Got Married 1, Why I Got Married 2. Hey, those movies are crazy, man. Get the Tyler Perry. Yes, mm. I think I've seen like three hey, Tyler Perry's movies are crazy, eh? And how, what did you think about it? Hey, it's did a mind fuck, eh? Did it encourage you to get married? No, 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 no. Are we getting married this year, Chief? Yeah. Yes. I know you said oh. you were getting old. Yes. Yeah, I know we are, eh, Chief. Hey, so are, you want to hey. get married this year? Do I wanna? Ah, yes. sir, so I want to attend a wedding, yeah. so You know, weddings also revive marriage. <laughs> 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 I need to be, I need to be revived. Yeah. No, so bona <laughs> All right. What do you want for the podcast in twenty twenty twenty? Uh, more growth. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And you see, like, you see what happened, right? Um, during December, ne? Mm. I think things got a bit rowdy, ne? Mm. And I don't know if you noticed, but you probably did, like, uh. The posters are gone, Chief. Oh, yeah. yeah. <laughs> <laughs> what happened? I forgot to ask, guys. What happened? <laughs> oh, is it a new look? <laughs> new year, new, new look. New year, new look. Yeah, <laughs> it's a new vision. Let's, let's leave it at that. Let's it's a new vision a new in year, the studio. Just think I lost contacts. <laughs> <laughs> lost posters. Posters. <laughs> <That's> <laughs> I have a new year. Drop oh, that shit. fucking thing of yours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I know. Hey, Dizzy was very Dizzy. Is it one, one or two goodness. days when things were going a bit? Yeah. So I since the podcast, are, I mean, the posters are gone, what are we going to do now? Because we, we need a look, bro. I, I, I don't know. So the chillers must suggest something at least. Yeah, let now. us know, chillers out there. Because either we do this for <laughs> you guys anyway. So what do you want to see in the back? Yeah, what, what, should, we, what should we change? Must, yeah? I, must I get your son, give him crayons and be like, <laughs> decorate the wall. <laughs> yeah, ne? Yeah. Yeah, because it does look a bit dry. I'm like, something's missing here. Mm. It's hard. Yeah, these things happen. But you're yeah. also missing a cap. Mm. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. I could <laughs> you said I must take it off. No, I thought you left it in vendor. Oh, yeah. in 2019. <laughs> new year, new me. Yes, no more. Uh, caps. Are metric r- uh, results out yet? No, they're coming, they're coming out, out tomorrow. Tomorrow, tomorrow. As in like oh. Tuesday, the seventh of Jan, January. All right. Good luck to all the matriculants out there, man. Hopefully, you passed. Did you pass? In my matric? Yeah, <laughs> yes. Well, I actually asked you guys to bring your matric results. Did you bring them? <laughs> ah, but they're in Porch, Muna. Ah. Oh, you mean, no, no. You mean like physically bring the certificate or just like inquire about what happened? So no, you remember I said in the group, guys, can you guys bring your matric ah, results? I'm already in Jobe. Oh. Call your mother. She must ah. take a picture. Yeah, read it. Oh, it. Like, <laughs> <laughs> You know, <laughs> you brought your results. No, I didn't. You didn't bring your results. I still kind of remember them. Ah, guys, I'm the one who brought my results. You, brought, you actually brought your own results here. Yes. I wrote them down here. You can see my results. Ah, but what if I also have my oh. SMS? Mm-hmm. Uh, if you did, I'll just Google them. I'll Google them. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so. And you have to pay if you lose your matric certificate yes, to get a new one. Yeah, you have to get one, a right? reprint. Yeah, yeah. Okay. Okay, so I'll tell you guys my results, and then next episode, you guys will bring your. Mm. No, results. I'll tell you mine. I still remember. No, you I still remember, I still yours? remember I mine. Oh, know, you remember? Okay, I know my average. Yeah, okay. Yeah. Should I start then? Yeah, start. Mm. Okay, Matt's standard grade. 56. Hey! <laughs> Accounting higher grade, 48. Oh. Yeah, no, it was crazy. Okay. okay. And, and, you sure. and you did yeah. accounting, Ash. Yeah, I did no, accounting. No, no. I wanted to be a CA. Oh, okay. I'm 48. <laughs> <laughs> He Wishful thinking. He was gonna proper cook the books this one. <laughs> <laughs> uh, science high grade forty three. Mm. Oh, that showed me flame. Science, mm. yes, yes. I even had to go for extra lessons, and <laughs> I still got forty three. <laughs> <laughs> uh, English high grade fifty eight. Mm. Not too shabby. Mm-hmm. Computer science fifty four. Mm. Only black said, student. To but be I thought you said class. you were a geek, Munda. Huh? You said you were a geek. Yeah, my man, this was IEB, Munna. <laughs> <laughs> oh, IEB. No, IEB. IEB. Like the private yeah. school. Oh. The yeah. ones that, the bougie ones that come out first. Yeah. Oh. And then African standard grade. I don't even need to say it. No, it's fine. Wait, we want to hear. Want to hear. <laughs> 36. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you 
giving wait, hope wait, to wait, 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 <laughs> 2019 wait, 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 matriculants. Wait, 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 your Afrikaans mark was what? 36. Murskond. <laughs> <laughs> so what can you say in Afrikaans? <laughs> Drop the fucking thing of yours. <laughs> and you know what's crazy? In Afrikaans, if you got 34, they round it up to the nearest thingy number which is 35 and 35 was a pass <laughs> wasn't so the pass 33 comma three yes, yes 33, so comma 33, three. Comma three. Yeah. yeah and then they run it <laughs> <laughs> so you got rounded off <laughs> about to the stephens and this is standard grade yo standard grade wow <laughs> was more, yeah. were you those were you those people okay like i know myself with africans i also like i think i was in like 48 and you know when for the comprehension yes when they ask you a question yes so you just Whatever question, you'll go look for the whole sentence inside yes, 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 <laughs> the yes, story. Yes. And then you write everything. Yes. Then it'll be like for one mark. Yes. <laughs> they want one word. You just write Yeah, five, that was lines. Lines. the whole five sentence. Lines. I did that too. Ah, talk about winging it. You, ghost lady? I Okay, I went to an art school. Mm. So I got distinctions in Disclaimer. <laughs> Yes, yes. <laughs> I went to school, so <laughs> I'm more powered on the art side. Don't okay. don't judge me on the mm. the literature. It's okay, and, it's okay, yeah. it's okay. Um, I did English, Afrikaans, obviously. I was just dead there. Mm. Like, Let's start English. I was 48. 48, I remember that. One. Afrikaans? Yeah, English. Standard grade? Yeah, standard grade, definitely. Okay. All right. English. Uh, Afrikaans, 48. Yes. All right. English, it was 59 or 60. 59? 59 or 60 English, you know. I've been rolling. Mm. <laughs> and then I did science and maths. You did science? Maths was standard grade. Maths? Oh, something was standard grade and the other Both. one... No, someone was... Something was standard grade and science was higher grade. Oh, higher grade. it was maths, higher grade, science, standard grade. Mm. Okay. So I can't remember. But it was around uh, average around 60s. 60s no, for no, both? 50, 50s. For both. for both? For both, yeah. Regardless of standard or higher? Yeah. Okay. Yeah, yeah. And then the arts... <laughs> Are the art distinctions? I know. Chad. Which arts? Dancing? Uh, design? No, design. It was art drawing. Oh, oh I'm an artist. I'm a, I'm a you painter. You rap, you paint. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Design? Yeah. Yeah, design. I Obviously, above 80. Mm -hmm. And also art. Where it was I should have went to an art, art school. Because I could draw and mm. study the history of art. And I also did well there. Mm. Interesting. So, I get So, why are you here, Muzi? <laughs> 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 you could be at Market Theatre. <laughs> You are mean I don't know. <laughs> no. Or you draw. Oh, maybe I can draw the wall. Maybe I, yeah. I should. Ah. I should. Maybe I draw a painting for you guys. Ne? You should have done the logo. Now I'm busy. They putting cassettes. <laughs> Did you ever have oh, ambitions of being like a spray painter? Can what do you call them? Graffiti artists. Graffiti artists. Artist. Graffiti artist. No, no. Uh. If anything, my ambition one day is to actually have an art gallery. Mm. I'd love that. Mm. An art gallery. So, um, bo bo Mona Lisa, so. Yes, okay. All right, let's go to Leonce. Did you make it? He's one of, one of those ones that Leon. make it in the newspaper. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> he didn't only just bring his certificate, he brought the newspaper. Highlight. <laughs> From his mom who's kept it in the kist. <laughs> yeah, it's even underneath the, yes. in, in, the, in, the, in, the, in the folder thing, yes. <laughs> Top achiever. Hmm? Um, Tell us oh, very English old. was 70. You don't have a disclaimer. Yeah. No, no, I don't have a disclaimer. <laughs> Is that I did more subjects than others. Oh, yeah, I did seven subjects. Okay, Thank you. hey now, hey now, hey now. <laughs> All right, 70. 70 English higher grade. Okay, African 63 higher grade. Yo! Yo! You're kidding. I kid you not. Higher what? Grade. Yes. Okay. Grade say, the, say all your marks in Africans. Let's, <laughs> 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 Let's see. I can <laughs> say the subjects, not the numbers. Okay, uh, try even numbers. Okay, ah, says and Darda. <laughs> Just say it opposite. Next. Uh, wait, where was I? African 63, 63. Ne? Higher grade. Man. Accounting oh. 81, higher grade. 81! Hi. And you didn't want to be a CA? Uh -uh. <laughs> <laughs> I knew you my struggles. You <laughs> I knew my struggles. <laughs> Drop the fucking thing of yours. <laughs> I either wanted to become a lawyer or a journalist. That's it. Wow. I don't know why I did those subjects. Though. But as a collective, you and I, I wonder if we combine 68 and 81. Yeah. <laughs> we can go very far. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, okay, that's accounting. High grade 81, dog. Yeah. Yuck. Shit, you got to higher than Murish, and Murish is a CA. Oh. Mm. No, I, the thing with me is we had a bet with our accounting teacher. Mm. She totally told us, like, none of you are going to get above 80. So you're saying, had I had, had a bet? I don't know. That's how we <laughs> functioned. 
<laughs> that's how we functioned. <laughs> no, your teacher would have won <laughs> with you. <laughs> okay. And then Should you even go further, bro? Science, no, 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 no. Science kicked my ass. I got 43. Oh, oh welcome. Welcome. Oh, <laughs> happens don't worry <laughs> higher grade science was what uh 43 higher grade 43 mm. higher grade i got more than you oh mm. we got the same shit mm. got the same uh Matt, the only thing that i did on standard grade was 51 Matt. Mm. yeah standard grade yeah 51 and then yeah, i got more than you <laughs> <laughs> so you feel clever <laughs> <laughs> okay officially, officially then, our numbers guys yeah and then history on higher grade i got 67 history mm. uh, what the fuck would you do history seven, right? which it was a challenge between myself and my friends on some like let's do a seventh subject and see who gets more from it and you love challenges you love challenges which one was it history uh how, mu- how much was it? 67 we just order, whenever grade. we want something from lenny 67 challenge mm. we challenge you let's cha- let's do a challenge who's gonna make more money this year <laughs> oh he's gonna win <laughs> But as, as long as you know, what's yours is the podcast. <laughs> <laughs> it belongs to the podcast. <laughs> Drop that fucking thing of yours. <laughs> How do you calculate money? Outside Qatar. No. <laughs> if I, if I, no. You see, you see why I didn't be accounting. Accounting, mm. Shaila mm. Lapoy. <laughs> CA. I get at work if you come up with an idea and you're sending it via the work email. It's the in works international yeah, problem. Exactly. Fair enough. Yeah. So this is an idea that came from the podcast. <laughs> fair enough. Fair enough. Fair enough. So if you write a book and it sells money and it makes a lot of money, <laughs> don't worry. Yeah. Thank it's you, Len. I see Lenny Mark. And surprisingly enough, oh, man. all the people that I went to school with are like engineers, CAs, whatever. In terms of careers, not that I'm looking down on what I yeah, do. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm like lowest from them. Wow. Oh. As doing well, I'm the one who studied journalism. People were studying uh, law. Mm. And the only reason why I didn't study law was because I was accepted for law at Rhodes. Oh. But at the last minute, I was like, the Eastern Cape is too far. <laughs> I want something close. I'm mm. not going to go there. And then that's when I went to UGC. That's UGC. why you like arguing. Mm. Yes. Yeah. So you're using us as our guinea pigs. Yes. Who is guinea we pigs? We have to win the case. <laughs> <laughs> have his Land on the case. <laughs> <laughs> have his back. Drop that fucking <laughs> thing of yours. <laughs> <laughs> but I'm not one of those when like cases are happening and I come in there like, yeah, no, I think, uh, uh, what, what, inging. No, no, no. I, t- I just know law from afar. From afar. Do you think you would have been a good lawyer though? I think I would have. No? I think I would have. Mm. So. In fact, my friend who is actually a lawyer as well, Lungela. Lungela, yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. Nice. It's one of those things that we discussed when we were like, ah, we're going to do oh, this. Yeah. Cute. Mm. But then I chickened out. Let's take a course this year, me and you, and see who finishes it. What? We're now political. <laughs> 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 we can't even go there. Look at you using Lele's motivation. <laughs> I see where We're you're going, going back to school, guys. <laughs> <laughs> using me as much. Ghost lady will buy our stationery <laughs> in uniform. <laughs> <She knows. laughs> Actually, I want to go back. There's a course I want to do. Not even a course. I want to like get into psychology. Actually. Oh, that'd be nice. Yeah. Oh, yeah, you'd be good at that. Even I'd my husband listener. is willing to say, he was like, ah, if you want to, it's fine. Yeah. yeah. I actually envy people who work and study at the same time. Yeah. Not and now study. It, I'll, I'll quit work. Oh, okay. And go back full time. That's a different story. I envy people who study, period. (laughs) (laughs) People who just open books. (laughs) People who enter libraries. (laughs) Wow. People who Google. (laughs) Oh, God. But we live in an era of Google. So remember the last time we spoke on it on the the, the podcast? There's a lot of careers now that you can wing because you watch the YouTube video. Oh, have his exactly. Yeah, but yeah. but I think a at, the, channel. <laughs> at the core of it, you must still go to school, Shem. Yeah, yeah, yeah. it's a good thing. Anyway, yeah. So, uh, uh, good luck to everybody, man. And if you fail, hey, yeah. listen, man. You know, it's, it's not, not the end of the world. It's not the end of the world. We passed accounting, science, yeah. computer science. We come, come out here. Come on, daughter, score. <laughs> you know, come on, man. You just slip in. Yeah. You know? so. And now we have a YouTube channel. You know what I mean? <laughs> and we ain't got, it's got fuck all to do with computer science. <laughs> There's no coding here. Nothing. Nothing. Yeah, anyway. Yeah. Uh, I got some announcements to make. Our website is finally up. We are live and direct. This Woo-hoo. is MacG.com. <laughs> finally. Yeah. So, yeah. Uh, mm. So, yeah. If you want to buy t-shirts, we can go directly to 
our new website. Have you guys checked it out? No, I haven't. Had you chance. haven't? No. Yeah, but we're live now. It's live now. Yeah. So that's where you can go if you want t-shirts. And or you can just do your orders there. Yeah, you can just do. There, yeah, 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 yeah. Order via WhatsApp. Because we've got a company, Envy Africa. They're going to yeah. be doing the t-shirts from now on. Handling. Yeah. Nice. Oh, that's cool. Yeah, yeah. yeah. That's dope. That's super nice. Mm. Uh, what else do I need so to announce? So you don't have to uh, WhatsApp learn. <laughs> nah, no, no <laughs> more. T-shirts. No more, no more. Thank God. So I Those need are to things announce. we left in 2019. Yeah. yeah. Mm. Website. What else should we announce? Mm. Oh, there's a lot of dope stuff we're doing this year, man. We're excited. Yeah, yeah. There's, oh, a, there's, there's quite a man. lot of things that we have in mind. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, you know this year is a leap year, right? It's exciting. Is it? Oh, it's yeah. a leap year. Yeah. Sick. So there's 29 days in Feb. Yes, well, it's 366 days in the year, but yeah. 29 days in February. Right? Nice. Yeah, those are all the announcements I needed so to make. Just the website. What else website. am I missing? Mm. Oh, who do you want us to interview first? Yes. Oh, yeah. I want to get Gabza. You want to get Gabs? Yeah, man. You made the whole country dance in, in December. Man, you want to chase it? Ah, t- you didn't answer my phone. You, you didn't even call back. <laughs> 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 hey, boy, I saw your missed yeah. call. <laughs> okay. <laughs> but he's a busy guy. He's a yeah, busy he's guy. A busy right? yeah. He's probably yeah. cooking another hit. I don't, I don't, I don't think... Would, would, you, would, you, would you live the life of... Just take the December alone. Would you live my Parisa's life? Dude, you do know I was once a big... Mm. Big time DJ <laughs> back you in my had days. That life. <laughs> <laughs> look, look, I've had that life. It's a young man's sport, man. You gotta be like young, dude. Yeah. If your kidney is failing and your livers are <laughs> fucked, <laughs> stay at home, chief. <laughs> <laughs> I saw Boogie did. <laughs> You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Ah, it does. It's, 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 it's a young man's game. Yeah. I don't know how a ski road it does it, bro. Because he's been rocking. And he even has a hit. There was a, there was a, some young track that I was listening oh, to. Oh, the piano one. The is piano it, oh, yeah. one, yeah. Is it with Zonke? There's one with Zonke. Yeah. There's another one oh, where he okay. takes you to church. It's, yeah, it's got a church vibe to it. Yeah. Oh, church grooves never stay behind. <laughs> <laughs> they always stay. <laughs> you can't forget that prayer. Of course. Mm. Oh, but before we get out of here, because I'm... Should we end off with Chili's prayer? At the end of the episode? Yes. Ne? yes oh, yeah, yeah. I'll chop it up. I'll chop it okay, up. Okay, cool. The news of Maponya, Dr. Richard oh, Maponya. Oh, yeah. Another loss. Like eh? a pioneer oh. of business, bro. Like, you realize, I think, in this whole country, he's the first black person, probably even amongst other races, to name a mall after himself. Yeah. Maponya mall. Yeah. Like, you know how excited people were to go to Maponya when mm. it was first built? When I think it, it was started, 2007. Yeah. Mm. Like, going there, taking a picture next to the, to the elephant. Mm. Eh. Like, going to Maponya mall was an, was an excursion. If you come to Joburg, you make sure, like, Goldrip City. Mm. Eh, what else is there? Joburg Zoo. McDonald's. McDonald's. <laughs> Maponya mall. <laughs> I'm talking from experience. <laughs> <laughs> but isn't there one in wow. London now? Yeah, there is, but not by where I stay, but oh, the, by okay. the villages. Yeah, oh. but a pioneer, man, a pioneer. Rest in peace. He inspired a lot of people, and I Dr. think Dr. Richard Mapon. I think I think he's his generation of businessmen, and in all the time, have you ever heard one scandal, one scandal about Dr. Richard Mapon? Uh, there were no slave queens back then. Uh, no, they ah. were they were now. It doesn't matter. Mm-hmm. No slave queens have been there, chief. Our mothers were. <laughs> And on that note, it's a wrap. We are here. We'll be back next week. Let it boost your mother. How are you, mother? Maribu say. Drop that fucking thing of yours. Thanks, Sophia Town. Don't you know how shit. Guys, don't you don't you know your histories? Don't tell us about your mother. Don't make it our history. Your history. No, no, no. My mother was not a slave queen. Nah, no, no, no. She wasn't. She was she was cool. Yeah? Alright, cool. Yeah. Let's do it. I go as the the father. Must we close hmm? eyes? No, we don't need to close our eyes. Oh, we don't close eyes? Yeah. Okay. You repeat after me. Okay, I repeat after you. Yeah, if I'm the father, you I'm say our father. Our father, all right, cool. Who art on the airwaves. Who art on the airwaves. Hallowed be your name. Hallowed be your name. Your kingdom comes. Your kingdom comes. You will be done on the airwaves. You will be done on the airwaves. As it is on the ground and in heaven. As it is on the ground and in heaven. Give us this day. 
give us this day. Our daily dose of entertainment. Our daily dose of entertainment. And forgive those. And forgive those who try and become competitors with you. Yeah. Amen. Everybody show me love. Podcast and chill. Matt G, the ghost lady, and Lynn Moleko.